Meeting number 798 of Mumbai Toastmasters. It is such a pleasure to stand here and see you guys because that is kind of what I want to talk about today. See, sight. One of the privileges that some creatures on this planet have the ability to see. The ability of sight as a navigational tool is something that some creatures on this planet are gifted with. When you are able to understand what you are looking at and take actions on that particular basis, that's called vision. When you are able to see, understand and take steps, that means you have vision. I'm more interested in the adjective form of this, the visionary. Anyone who has vision, but is able to use that vision to understand the various futures available, the various outcomes available, and decide which is the right course of action to take, that person is a visionary. A visionary is a very powerful person to have around you because that is a person who knows exactly where he wants to go. Not only does he know exactly where he wants to go, more often than not, he also has a plan on how to get there. How do you become a visionary? There are a number of ways. But the number one way, the greatest way ever to be a visionary is to learn one thing, one. That thing is articulation. Articulation. Is articulation just a fancy way of saying, giving a speech? No. Articulation is the sum of two components. The ability to have something that people want to hear, to have content, to have knowledge, and the ability to be able to communicate that knowledge. Sum total of the two is equal to articulation. When you are able to articulate, the power you are unlocking is unlike anything, any physical gifts that you can ever have. Think Hitler, think Gandhiji, think Churchill. These are not people endowed with physical gifts, but they move nations, positive, negative, different debate. They moved nations. The power of being articulate is a skill I encourage all of you to develop. And what a better stage to develop that than the stage of the Mumbai Toastmasters. When you're giving speeches, you're going to hear evaluations. When you give table topics, you're going to be put into situations you didn't know you could handle. How do you handle those situations? Developing a sense of articulation. Today I challenge all of you, try to develop content which people would like to hear about. How? Be very mindful of what you consume. What do you consume? What books are you reading, if at all? What Instagram are you following, if at all? What YouTube are you consuming, if at all? What Netflix shows are you watching, if at all? Basis that, is anyone around you interested to hear about what you consume? If not, try to change. Try to add another layer to what you're consuming. If you are consuming positives and people around you are not as interested in hearing what you have to say, maybe you're not saying it well. Come on this stage and learn. Today is one unique meeting of the Mumbai Toastmasters because today we address our guests as future Toastmasters. We have the membership drive. To facilitate this membership drive, it is my absolute honor to let you all know that we have the division director present among us. For the benefit of guests, clubs, this is a club, the Mumbai Toastmasters. A lot of clubs are governed by an area. A lot of areas are governed by a division. A lot of divisions are governed by a district. That's the hierarchy of Toastmasters. We today have the division director and the area director present. May I please invite the division director, Mr. Akshay Singh, to please address us.